For this video, we'll be checking the scratch resistance of the Galaxy S24. If you're interested in seeing more videos like this, make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell so you'll be notified once I upload a new video. To start off, I'm going to be rubbing some sand and gravel on top of the screen so we can see if it gets any scratches. Looking at the screen, I can see numerous scratches. Next, I'll be using the Mohs Hardness Kit to test to see what level it scratches at. However, I find that sometimes my results with the Mohs Hardness Picks tend to differ from others. There could be many reasons behind that, some of which being how hard the picks are being pressed, as well as if the picks are calibrated or sharpened. The directions say to use medium force, so if you press down too hard, you will get scratches at lower levels. And for reference, here's the Mohs Hardness Table, which gives you some reference for the scratch levels. The regular glass starts scratching at a number 5 to 6, and you'll see scratches with quartz at a number 7. I'll be starting off with a level 5, and I won't be using the lower ones since for example a 1 or a 2 scratches plastic and the screen isn't plastic, so there's no point in testing that. Here's the number 5 pick. The glass is the same as last year's Galaxy S23, which is the Gorilla Glass Victus 2. Next, we're going with number 6. Followed by the number 7. So we can see some very faint scratches at number 6 and some deeper scratches at number 7. So as far as scratch resistance, there is no improvement. However, the design of the S24 with the frame seems to really help it for drops. And if you haven't seen the drop test video on the S24, you can check my recent videos. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the teardown.